Hey guys, I'm here at the park and I just wanted to do like a little quick video. I'm going to do a quick walk. I'm doing some power walking and uh, I'm really just sick of holding my device. I feel like it's starting to really mess with my hands, the radiation from it and uh, you know, so yeah. Anyway, so I'm going to do some walking, power walking and enjoy this beautiful day. Okay guys, now we're gonna do some uh, stretches after our power walk. I power walked for about 15 to 20 minutes and I can honestly say I needed it and it felt amazing to get that lymphatic system moving and flowing and getting all that stagnated garbage of trapped microscopic garbage in between the cells and get it moving through my body. So let's do some stretches.
Okay guys, if you want to do that along with me, uh, basically what I did is uh, I did some stretches and a few yoga poses at the end and I basically counted to 10 on each stretch and then I, uh, uh, I, uh, I did breathing some really deep breathing in between those stretches and those uh, postures. So, I hope you enjoyed that video. I feel totally exhilarated and just like so refreshed. Like, I needed that. So, and yeah, I had to like basically tell a friend, you know, that I couldn't talk right now. Uh, that was wanting to uh, talk to me before I did my run, so. You know, guys, we got to take care of ourselves. If we're constantly being controlled by other people and, you know, who's in control? Who's in control of you? You or other people? And guys, I hate to tell you this, but they ain't going to be there when Fat Lady sings, okay? They ain't going to be there when it's time to you know, go to the hospital because you didn't take care of yourself or you didn't exercise or whatever. Guys, you know, it, we're gonna be there. We gotta take care of ourselves. So I'm gonna get off my soapbox and drive. Okay guys, I just got home from running all those errands and went out to the grocery store. And um, we are now going to do a taste test on a watermelon. It is um, October. It's October 1st and we are going to taste, this is an Indiana grown watermelon. It's not organic, but uh, we're going to taste it. It was kind of expensive. It was $5.47 and it's not that big. See? In comparison to me and my face, it's not that big. But it'll do. I'd say half of it's gonna probably set me straight. So let's get into okay. it. Let's check this baby out. Check it out. Oh, 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 oh. something that Walmart has right now. Let's check it out. Let's see if these this is any good. The stem was tough, which means if the stem's tough, that means that it, I've had some good luck with the fruit at Sam's here lately. So I'm feeling lucky and they must be getting some better stuff. Oh, this looks pretty. Look at that. It looks crisp. Now let's see if it actually is. God, I love watermelon so much. Oh, it looks crisp. Let's taste it. It was 547. Mmm. Mmm. Good. Really good. I'm surprised. It's delicious. It's really good. Okay guys, check out this gorgeous salad. That is not a lot of raisins on there. It looks like a lot, but it is really not. But check out this phytonutrient rich, gorgeous salad that I made. It's got some um, lentil sprouts, some sprouted sunflower seeds, 
This is spinach, uh, chopped spinach. There's a bed of green leaf lettuce under all of this. And, um, you know, these are just little garnishments that I've put on top. They're, they're not that much. This is a small salad. As you can see, as my uh, fork and knife here in the ratio, I mean, it's a big salad. That's a big salad for me. It's a huge salad, but it's not like a huge, huge salad like some people eat. Um, but I've got some celery, chopped celery, and I've got some tomatoes or tomatoes like uh, Amelia Nicole would say. And I've got some um, avocado, and that's about it, guys. That's about it. So, um, you know, I'm trying to get some fats into my salad. I'm gonna put a little bit of coconut vinegar, not much. Just, I put a little bit on these, and I'm gonna uh, put some salt, some pink Himalayan sea salt, and maybe some pepper. But yeah, this is, I had the watermelon, I'm having this, and that's all that I've had to eat today besides the coffee and the um, black strap molasses. So I am trying to stick to my one meal a day, uh, but this has been kind of a dispersed intermittent fasting day because it was about two hours ago that I finished the watermelon. So technically.